in our outdoor lecture room. Very nice view. Geology is something that not a lot of people really think of as part of guiding. But for me personally, it is everything. Everything you see here comes from what you are seeing. And that's what we call Mother Earth. So I'm going to try and make it as short and effective as possible for you guys. I will highlight, you know, I will stress important areas that you need to know. But you are busy with your workbooks, so maybe after this lecture it will be a good idea for you to go and do your workbook, that section of geology. Because what I'm going to say you're going to find there, you may answer it without opening the book. If you listen and you make notes. Right. Obviously some of the questions there you will still need to research a bit. Um, but you're also welcome to come afterwards and inquire and, and find out what we've covered. So as I said, everything you see here comes from these rocks. As you can see here, only where you're sit, sitting already, there's a piece missing here. And you saw that slab there down where we had tea and coffee, that big slab that was lifted up by the rock thing there. That's all already in the process of moving down. And with the wind and the rain and other chemical factors, it's in the process of weathering down these rocks. And these rocks contain minerals. Okay, and those minerals end up in the soil. What grows in the soil? Plants. Plants. So if you have a nice jackalberry, like this one here, <coughs> young one, it's going to bear fruits. So that specific tree grows in that specific soil type with that specific mineral. And that jackalberry will obviously lure and attract birds, monkeys, baboons, uh, fruit bats, and uh, jackal okay? and obviously those animals again attract the predators and so forth and so on so everything is actually guiding revolves around geology 